Hi, I'm Andreas from Invest in Bavaria. And today we are here in Munich with one of our clients, the Israeli company Nano Dimension. I'm really happy to be here today. And I'm here with the general manager of the German entity, Valentin Stolz. Hi, Andreas. Andreas. Thanks for having us. Now we're here in your new offices. And how's everything going? Like you just moved in here recently. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good, actually. It was a struggle to get everything finished in time. We are here on the third floor mm -hmm. in the north of Munich. We have space for about 50 people and we have downstairs a lab with application research and material research. What was the reason you decided to come to Munich and set up the entity of Nano Dimension here? Well, it's uh, the airport. Mm -hmm. It's easy to travel from Tel Aviv in Israel and it's easy to travel from Boston where our US headquarters. Oh, yes. And of course the ecosystem we can find here with clusters of new materials, mm -hmm. nanotechnologies, additive manufacturing and several others. So we decided to build up here our European headquarter with focus also on research on applications and materials. Mm -hmm. But the, the clusters that you mentioned, they are not always based in Munich, are they? So from what I understand, they are based in Bavaria. They're based in Bavaria, so you have the whole network here that you can use. Yeah, for example, we are working already together with the University of Bayreuth or the EZD uh, and other researchers from several areas here mm -hmm. because we want to solve pretty big problems in the electronic industry and others. So Valentin, I can see some printers already set up here. I saw some laboratory equipment already. But what is the main focus of Nano Dimension here in Munich? So we have basically two stations here. One is the application research lab, which is located here, mm -hmm. where we have currently the Dragonfly printers and the SMTech machines, mm -hmm. which are combined used to develop new applications for electronics. Mm -hmm. But as you see here, we have more space and we are going to bring in here more machines from our portfolio mm -hmm. to develop together with customers things that could not be manufactured before. When companies are setting up in Bavaria, we quite often face the intercultural differences. How did you work with that? Uh, it's, it's a challenge. I'm coming from Baden-Württemberg, mm -hmm. so for me to get integrated in Bavaria <laughs> is difficult. No, seriously. We have an international team here, over seven nationalities, mm -hmm. from Mexico over Israel to Italy. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think the spice comes in with diversity and the opportunity to have different opinions working together to solve problems. Uh, and I guess it's also one of the strengths of Invest in Bavaria. How did you get in touch with Invest in Bavaria and when did the cooperation start? Uh, from the international office in Tel Aviv. So we were in contact with Jonathan from the mm -hmm. international office in Tel Aviv and uh, since I think three years we are cooperating. We founded together with uh, German company Hensold, mm -hmm. a joint venture that is named James mm -hmm. in Taufkirchen and we want to see what, what we can do together. Valentin, yeah. now all business aside, yeah. I have a personal question for you. How does your perfect day in Bavaria look like in summer and in winter? Uh, in winter skiing, in summer going to a lake and then in the beer garden. That's a, that sounds very really good and I'm joining you on that. Okay, very good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.